Parents and probation officers learned some ways to monitor a child's social media activity. The Partnership for Violence-Free Families hosting a social media training for parents and employees at the Allen County Juvenile Court. Organizers say while young people easily navigate the online world, sometimes they are too at ease and post compromising pictures and information. Adults are encouraged to stay up to date with social media in an effort to build a safety net when children make mistakes. There's a lot of sexting going on, there's a lot of um, bullying going on online um, and other activities that we kind of want to shield them from a little bit and having parents interacting with them um, and keeping an eye on them or community uh, people engaging with them online will kind of help them stay away from those behaviors. So I went over Ulrich describes social media as today's version of passing a note at school. However, when a message is sent through sites like Twitter and Facebook, it's often available for the whole world to see.